Yeah. We was, got that on our heads. Yeah, we still got the lingering effects of all the shit. Yes. Anyways. And then it, the, it turns out Smith & Wesson was behind the entire anti-civil rights movement. Yeah. Officer, I think a great twist would be new watch? If, if, like, you and Officer your cop partner were Smith & Wesson. You Edgar <laughs> uh, we have yeah, a Kaiser uh, Soze Mr. situation. Yeah. <laughs> he said he'd lie down. I'll buzz him for you. All right, take his He's last totally time. Go, 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 go. Yep. Son of a bitch. Go, Cole, go. Go, Cole, go, Cole. I was trying to, like... He's just fucking waving at you. Yeah, man. Hey. Yeah, I know you're running and all, but, uh, can I get your cop oh, advice? Kiss ass. He just doesn't want to get picked up for, uh, being off his parole. Because yeah, he heard what happened to that last guy. He got thrown off a fucking roof, man. That's yeah, some man. severe capital bass punishment. Look, man, he did a severe crime, all right? Yeah. Breaking parole is very serious. Let's go tackle this asshole. You know, I wonder how many people actually want to see this game played in black and white. Uh, two. Me and you. Probably two, yeah. Edgar Kalu, you're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage. Oh, he's fucking pissed his pants happy. In the case that breaks you. The one you never saw. I just broke a man's face today. <laughs> the case that gnaws at your guts and ruins your marriage. The case that keeps you propping up a bar as you relive the what ifs, the might have been. The case that toughens the nipples with the light. <laughs> the case that other cops murmur about whenever you walk past. The case you never, ever discuss. God's mill may grind slowly, but it grinds finely, son. I hear it's you who not our malefactor from the shooting yesterday. Yes, sir. Then tell me, Boyle. I hear you're quite the climber, a man of initiative. How would you like a the chance case of smiting this case that gets you laid. <laughs> you're asking me to, to conduct the interview, sir? I am, young Phelps. You've only been with us a short time, and you've assembled yourself a stellar arrest record. I threw a man off of a building. <laughs> Not to mention, you totally did that sick kill on that guy. I'm curious as to whether you could turn your hand to interrogation. It takes a certain animal cunning, lad. Do you think you might be ready for that? Yes, sir. I think I am. Good man. Show me the eye of the tiger. Many things for a conviction, young All I'm getting out of his thick accent is potato! <laughs> Potato Lucky Charms. I'm, I'm sorry, you want me to get a potato no from him, sir? <laughs> what? If you fail in the former, you can always use a potato Lucky Charms draw kick Murphy's. <laughs> How are you feeling now? Oh Boston. <laughs> you fucking go in there and all the writing on the notebook is the ask is ask for fruit loops is or lucky <laughs> lucky charms, is that what he said? Shish <laughs> This is your chance. Don't fail me. Get all the potatoes. <laughs> Just start banging a hammer on the desk. <laughs> Where are the potatoes? Where are they? Dude, pour his damn <laughs> coffee out. <laughs> pour it all over this nice yeah, desk. Yeah, see what that does for him. This is gonna be your upholstery in the next five <laughs> minutes if you don't tell me what's going on. Let's talk about the shooting. Do you deny shooting Everett Gage? I'm a businessman. I, I run a jewelry store. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure my lawyer can clear all this up. I doubt that. Well, I can't really see anything going on right now with his face because, uh, you know, <laughs> 1980s TV with a 12 inch screen. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. He is totally um, lying, but. I think he is. Here's the way the system works if you think they're telling the truth, you know, you press truth. If you think they're lying but you don't have any evidence for it you press x to doubt them but if you have evidence you can totally nail their ass with the y button okay actually press lie really fast just no 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 because you can back out of it you deny owning a browning pistol yeah Zero that's what we got to prove one, one, three, eight. i owned a gun yes but 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 it was stolen in a burglary a couple See, years ago that's the you can't prove i use my gun that's the bitch of this fucking game like before we press y it didn't have a clear up what we had to prove, you know? So we have to prove that he owns... Wait. A Browning? Wait, he's got, he's got the, uh... What's that it one. called? The gun shop's, uh... Yeah, do that log. You had the gun clean and bought a new box of ammunition. The store owner remembers you and where you were. Is that so? 
It's amazing what the nebishes are called when it suits them. I'm pretty sure Nebish is, is another one of those great 1950s, 40s, 30s racial slurs. Well, you know a lot more than me, man. Let's change the subject. You fasting for Yom Kippur, Mr. Cohen? Yeah, goddamn yeah, Nebish. You go, motherfucker. How about baseball? You're not denying you're a Jew, Mr. Kalu. This is America. It's not Germany. It's not a crime. Liar. I don't like Jews, Mr. Kalu. Yeah, and I guess you're one of them. Gage hated Jews, didn't he, Mr. Kalu? I don't know what you're talking about. It toughened your nipples, didn't it, Mr. Kalu? <laughs> Should we doubt or lie? I don't know. Do we? I'd lie. Are we supposed to come up with evidence that this guy I mean... hated Jews? Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure if he's got like a Nazi flag hanging out the front of the store, <laughs> that's that's like the only way we'll be able to definitively uh, prove that. Yeah, I said doubt. Doubt. All right. You left-wing leaning parasite. You expect me to sit here and listen to your drivel? You Goddamn lefty. That? You sit there and you call me those names, you goddamn goy butt snatcher. What you the fuck? Stump Gage. Stump. Why did you do it, Mr. Kalu? Gage. He's in the Chamber of Commerce. He's in with all those momsers. He blocked every proposal I ever put forward. Kite this and kite that. He's been trying to ruin my business for years. Edgar Kalu. I'm charging you with the first degree That's murder the of That's the first Edgar fucking Gage. time we've done that shit. <laughs> I know. No way. Right to hold and the only thing I feel I achieved from that was all these great Jewish racial slurs that I got. Oh, man. You goy motherfucker. <laughs> what? <laughs> you schmuck. Oh, dude. I'm gonna put these in my database for later. <laughs> Masterfully done, Officer Phelps. But did you get the potatoes? <laughs> Isn't it, lad? Yes, what are you asking me, you goddamn <laughs> nebbish? Let's see how he reacts to that. It might be an Irish thing, I don't know. He just asked for more potatoes, man. I don't know what he wants. <laughs> I applaud a man with your talent for unwavering justice. Get yourself two suits, get them pressed. You'll be needing them. Yeah, you can't be uh, playing as a cop in an LA Noir game. <laughs> Actually dressed up in a police officer's uniform. We gotta get a nice shiny ass suit for that. Ah, we fucking passed we did that. everything. Nice, and only we... two people were brutally murdered and... when I was driving. <laughs> and you threw a guy off a fucking roof. Yep, that too. But he broke parole, therefore yeah. he deserved it. All right, all right. I'm gonna let you take over. I'm gonna go grab a drink Fuck. real quick. I'll be all back right, in man. a second. Sweet. So I gotta entertain the audience. Yes. All right. That's the idea. Good. I've been having Come something on. I wanted to ask the audience Don't actually. Fuck this up. Okay. So, audience, it's a damn lock, man. All right, Sloan was having trouble with the door, but it's okay. All right, there is something I wanted to ask you, the audience. And so, recently I was rewatching, or not rewatching, I actually went back and I watched Valkyrie with Tom Cruise in it. And, you know, I think Tom Cruise is pretty attractive. I mean, crazy, sure. But, I mean, like,. I just want to know if, if the UD audience had the opportunity, you know, to get with Tom Cruise, would you take that? And you know what I expect? I expect every single person to hear that, to say, hell yeah. But, you know... Here's your new desk, kid. Oh, You're on traffic. What's going on here? The hot sheet is posted here, next to the map. What's his problem? That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss is about. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes past my place? They haven't even approved the money yet, kid. The bond issue won't be till December. It'll be years before any of this will happen. Here's your new partner, Stefan Burkowski. Heard all about you, Phelps. You go easy on me and let me earn the odd citation, and maybe we'll get along fine. I'm here to learn, Detective. Oh, he's an intense one, isn't he, Mel? It's intense. The newly minted detective here, Cole Phelps. Hi, Phelps. I'll be keeping an eye on you. I could spend a little time basking in reflected glory, make a change from busting hookers and dope fiends. All right. Who was that? Roy Earl, chief detective and advisor. They all dressed yeah, like he's a dick. Well, Roy is a movie star. And the whole of the seedy side of L.A. is his audience. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Stick with me, kid. You'll find out. What? Hey, now, so now hey you're back. Warm Central Division I was talking about Tom Cruise Cole to Phelps. the audience. Uh, I see. That beautiful, Some beautiful man. Know, he is. He is the attractive one. Yep. He's the, he's the uh, he's the main argument for it's not all right, hot sure. chicks are crazy. Sometimes it's hot men, too. 
Phelps is one oh, of only man. two serving LAPD officers who received the Silver Star during the war. That's you gave it to those lousy Japanese, eh, Phelps? Uh, I did my best, Captain. Why you war heroes always so modest? I'm partnering Phelps with everybody's favorite pole, Stefan Bukowski. All right, Stefan. Bukowski like sure as hell doesn't. Well, that's why we have partners, right? <laughs> okay, okay, can it, guys. Stick with Bukowski. He's a good cop. He knows traffic inside now. I'm going to start you out with one case. You okay? I'll give you a couple more. You screw up, you'll be rousting vagrants and running license plates. Now get down to the PE Freight Depot, 6th and Alameda. Patrolman called in a suspicious vehicle. Signs of foul play. See what you can find out. Come on. Oh bro. my god, this mission. Oh man. I remember this mission. This was uh, something else. 